I love this for back to school. I was out doing a totally different story and I was interviewing the sheriff in Douglas County when he hit me with some truth about parenting. Take a listen to what he had to say about today's modern parent. You know, we kind of got away from parenting. Parenting want to be their friend instead of being parents. Look in your kid's room, look in his book bag, check his phone. Just do the thing that a parent was done back when we was parents. They got away from the real raising of a child. We got to get back to that. It's very hard to be a good parent. And man, and I man, agree with yeah. him. <laughs> I feel like you were probably sitting there like, yes, sir, tell, tell, me, me, tell more. me more. Tell me more. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's hard to be yeah. a good parent. And he brings up a lot of questions about privacy, I think. Do you check your kid's phone? Do you check in their book bag? How much are you monitoring this? You're as that it's going mom? I'm that you? mom. Listen, <laughs> my youngest is three, my oldest is 11, and I will spy for their benefit. Right. You know, for their benefit. Because. They're not old enough to make great choices. I would like to help them do that. I yeah. need to know what's going on, especially as they get older. You know, I, I'm going to spy. I know it's not popular, but I'm go I'm I may or may not have already done it. Well, Let's this also makes way. me think of the old saying, it takes a village to raise yeah. a child. And that's what he's saying. You know, everyone was really involved in the child rearing growing up. And yeah. I appreciated that. You know your teacher was going to call. Mm -hmm. You cut up. She has a, a good relationship with your mom mm -hmm. or the neighbor down the street. If you were cutting up at her house or she sees you. Yeah. You know, I remember the time oh. I, I tried to wear that red lipstick to school and my mom found out my aunt was a lunch lady. <laughs> So she was a part of the village. And so it really takes everyone to sort of be on the little spy game. It's right. My mom would say, you do it. I'm going to hear about it. Just know that right off the bat. And that is 100% true. I posted this on my Facebook page, and people had thoughts about what the <laughs> sheriff had to say. Breezy weighed in, and he actually said he grew up with Sheriff Pounds as the sheriff in his community. Oh, really? And he said there were so many times that this sheriff could have taken us to jail for so many small things. Instead, they pulled us to the side, alone or in a group, gave us a good preaching to, uh. and made us pour out our beer and get a ride home. <laughs> yep. So they were there as that village. They were saying, we're going to watch out for you. We're going to make sure you're doing the right thing. But then we have a little bit of a different view saying, you know what, parenting has gotten lazy. And mm. that's the point I'm not sure about. This man is 100% right, says Marsha. Each generation of children gets lazier and lazier and continues to live off parents way past the age of 18. So I don't know if that's true or not. Well, I mean, financial times, you know, things are much more expensive and it takes a lot more to get to that point where you're able to live on your own. You think about the cost of living. So that's the flip side that I would say with that comment. Mm. It takes a lot more to get your adulting on these days. I'm still figuring it out. And I, I'd say, with our four kids, we are trying to teach them to have a work ethic. We have chores, they have responsibilities, because it's really up to the experience we give them how lazy or not lazy they'll be. <laughs> True. My parents, like, there was, there was a line, and if I didn't live up to it, I, I had a little fear, you know what? And, yeah. And, and I think that is a conversation now. You know, there are parents that are doing their best. They have two, they have three jobs, they may or not be able to be at home. I think we can be so quick as parents to judge each other, mm -hmm. but we don't always know what everyone is going through and I think there's a lot of parents that are just doing their best but circumstances can be really difficult. Right. Good and to I know I got you guys to have my back when that time comes. We yes. have lots of I information to give you. Moms with a lot of thoughts here. Hey we want to hear your thoughts as well. We're going to keep these conversations going all throughout the day. Perspective for fanning the flames. Let us know in the comments. Be sure to also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Drop us a comment below. You see we're going to share them on the show. Check back tomorrow. Same place, same time. We'll be here for a live FI. Thanks for hanging out with us.